Hello everybody, this is Charles and back on a toy review. This time I'm gonna take everybody down a trip to memory lane as I review Star Saber! Star Saber, um, old toy that I had, you know, I had it since I was young. So this is a vintage toy. Um, it's been through a lot of playing and um, the, the yellow has, the toy has yellow, I mean the white, a lot of it has gone yellow uh, unfortunately over time, but you know what? This is still a great toy, G1 toy rocks simply because they are vintage and because you know they are Transformers vintage toys so that's the simple reason why they are they are good and you know it's really great you now as a toy uh, itself very nice a lot of fun uh, as a child I really love it despite the fact now a lot of parts are you know tight or loose but it's really a great toy so anyway I'm just gonna keep the landing gear inside this is Star Saber uh, the whole ship is really really cool you know you know imagine your kid you have this toy you just simply love it. I'm just gonna split Star Saber out first. Uh, I'm gonna go release this. Take this out. And here you have the plane mode. This little, little plane. Star Saber. Really nice looking jet. Uh, fun. Cool looking jet. And uh, of course, if you take it out here, you see the Brain Master. Not much of an articulation, just hands moving about. And you can push this up. That shows Star Saber's head. Anyway, to transform him, pull this out, flip this up, press this yellow button, pull it down. You flip the wings back, you flip this up. Okay, you need to take this out, but I'm gonna use uh, my teeth to do it. Okay, one side done, the other side done. Okay, I'm gonna, I use my teeth to actually reach this, uh, to actually get this out because it's really too tight. The toy is really old and tight and I'm sure some of us as kids when we can't get the fist out we just use our teeth to dig it out. Don't tell me you've never done this before, right? I'm sure some of you have done this. Put the Brain Master in. Okay, push it up and there we have him. Yay! And we put the shield over here and we're supposed to take the gun. Okay, from the Starship. The gun. Place it here and voila! Star Saber, not much of articulation, you know, just front back motion for the arms. Basically, that's it. Okay, so I'm gonna put him aside and go to the main body. Main body, simple, flip the wings back, wrench this out. Ugh, as you can hear, the joints are really, really tight. Okay, so I really gotta use a lot of strength. Uh, to do it, and fortunately, nothing's breaking yet. Uh, gotta dig this out. Okay, to dig this out, need to dig this out as well. I'm gonna use a gun to push it a little bit. Oh man. Okay, get this out. Okay, move the video back a little bit. Pull the fist out. Okay, and this is very tight. <sighs> This is okay. And here we have the body. Over here, transform him back. Move the hands up. Keep the fist. Alright. Push this two down. Flip, flip, flip up. Alright. Fit the Brain Master in. Press, close it. Close it. And this is Star Saber in this show. Okay, in anime, you probably see Star Saber a lot of times in this mode. When he's not in battle mode. Uh, but when he's in battle mode, he will raise the head up and this will cover, see? He will raise the head up fill up a little bit cover and there is Star Saber and of course, what Star Saber without his sword? the chromes are faded but none other still great toy to have let's put the sword here okay move it up and here is Star Saber. Can cool his gun here as well. Okay, as you can see, Star Saber is uh, pretty yellow, but no, nonetheless, still a great G1 toy. Uh, of course, on his own, he looks a little bit uh, stocky, but when you combine with a Vitrillo, that's how good he really, really looks. No G1 toy, really classic. See if I can move the camera a little bit more to get a full view of Star Saber. I think I can. So this is Star Saber. 
really really nice G1 Star Saber all right so here's Charles uh, signing off with another toy review I hope you guys have enjoyed do stay tuned to my channel for more reviews next time